Okay, so how do we get WeChat on your computer or laptop? Very simple. We have to first use a Android emulator. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is um, download this Android emulator. It's called uh, bluestacks.com. Go to that website. I'll post it on the bottom as well. And of course, you can uh, you download it for Windows or you can download it for the Mac. So I have a Windows here, so I'm going to download this. And you can see it downloading down here or about halfway there. It's only a little bit less than nine megabytes. Okay, so BlueStacks has. Um, is done downloading. Now I'm going to do is uh, go ahead and install this. Okay, so we want to continue down here on the right, bottom right. Continue. Now, when you get to this right here, uh, BlueStacks runs the best with the following enabled. Uh, I would recommend to uh, just uncheck all of these and then we're going to go to install. Now this is going to take a little while. Okay so finally it's, um, it's done uh, installing. I think it took like 15 minutes. It took a while. Anyways, what you want to do is, um, oops, sorry, I'll show you again. So after you're done installing, uh, this is the BlueStacks uh, page here. And what you do is you click on, you want to find WeChat. You want to install WeChat now. So you go up here, you can see, we'll do a search. And we'll type in. <clears throat> WeChat, and we'll click on find, wait for it. And there we go. We have several things. What we want is this top one, this plain one. It just says WeChat. And of course, we install this bad boy. <clears throat> Give it a few moments here. Okay, and this window will pop up. And you can just click the first one here. It says WeChat. And let us download now. Okay, all right. It just got done. Now what happens, it just got done, so it looks like nothing uh, actually happened, but what you have to do is uh, just go ahead and close this. Just close it. And then what we do is uh, we'll go to My Apps now. Click on My Apps. And we just see WeChat, and you can see it down here. There you go. I want to click on that. Let it load up. Create a uh, shortcut on your desktop. Yeah, sure. Okay. And then from here, of course, you can uh, log in or you can sign up. Okay. If you don't have WeChat already, if you have WeChat already, go ahead and log in. Well, it says, you can't always see it, but it says log in right here. And then, of course, what you can do is. Um, you can put your phone number in, or you can, uh, let me see, I think you can do this too. Or you, if you have an uh, account ID, you can put your account ID in here, or your email address and your password, your uh, password. Now, if you haven't done this yet, I, I would recommend to you to uh, link your email to your WeChat. Uh, this is just in case if you ever uh, lose your WeChat, or if you lose your phone, you, the only thing you have on there is uh, on your phone. If you link it to your WeChat, then you can... Uh, log in to several different places as long as you have a, a WeChat application and this way you'll never lose any of your contacts either so anyways yeah this is pretty much how you do it uh, now another thing is too you can see how the screen is a, this this part is a little bit small it used to be bigger I mean when I downloaded this originally like a year ago it was a previous version of WeChat and it was like longer for some reason it's updated version now it's like a little bit smaller so I haven't found the setting or anything to fix this yet, or we might just have to wait for the uh, next uh, update. Uh, anyways, I'm going to go ahead and uh, 
let me just go ahead and cancel this and and all your functions are down here too now you can see you can I mean here's the settings here is uh, in order to open it it's, it's on your desktop it's called blue stacks you just double click that and you wait for that to fire up and then you just click on WeChat and then um, that's pretty much it. Thanks. Uh, actually, hold on. So this is the first time I'm starting a WeChat on this uh, laptop here. I just done like two of them. These are my parents' computers and they wanted to put WeChat on their PC because they don't have a smartphone. So anyways, yeah. So you just click on this right there and that should work.